intriguing, Mr. Black. It seems you do have some memory of this place. Which means what, exactly? I wouldn't want to speculate at this point. I'm sure the implications will become clear. So, who am I looking for here? Rose? Jasper? Perhaps even both? Let's just see what we can find out, shall we? identified Rose Atkins and Jasper Prado I knew they'd be sending their inside man but I never knew he was oh, what a gorgeous how you doing to me I'm Jasper and I'm very pleased to meet you you can cut the flattery Mr. Prado I know who you are our employer has filled me in filled you in lucky bastard I'm sorry nothing nothing I get it you're a professional type I suppose you want to see the setup. Cross the eyes, dot the T's. All that shit. Yes, Mr. Brando. Please, show me round. Their first meeting. That's a start. Get as much information as you can, Mr. Black. Be meticulous. Understood. Knock-knock, Chief. Jasper, I presume. Your girl sent me through here. You must be he. Take a seat. This is fucking all right, eh? Can I get you a drink? Art. Fucking art. I, I never could get my head around it. I, I mean, it's nice and all, you know. Pretty. Fucking pointless, surely. Would you like a drink, Jasper? Ah, fucking right, I'd like a drink, son. Some fancy shite and ice would be grand. I don't keep ice in my office. Jesus Christ. Walls lined with more than fucking leases, but no ice for a thirsty man to drink. You want to practice a little more hospitality if we're going to get along, you know? <laughs> Man of your caliber should be able to take care of his guests. I mean, it's not so much about the ice, per se. Jasper, this is a 62-year-old single malt whiskey. Notes of blood orange and treacle, hints of apple and ginger. Very nice. Not to be gauche, but it fetches around 20k a bottle. Fuck me. You don't have it with ice. You drink it at room temperature. And whether or not we're going to get along, Jasper, is based on one very simple condition. Very simple. Can you imagine what that might be? Listen, I didn't mean... It's that you do what I say. Of course. Look, I... I get on very well with people who do what I say. Now, take a seat.
Okay. What do I need to do this time? Search the memory for Rosa Atkins. Find out who her employer was. Find out why she would turn on me after I gave her everything. Okay. And then we will find out your involvement, Mr. Black. We still need to know why you were there. Where is this? I don't know this place. Ah, yes. Homewood Cemetery. I'm afraid I do. And if the Pandora has brought you here, then you do too. And how do you know this place? It's next to the company building. It allowed Rose and I to have a certain privacy. Looks like we met here too. So where is she? Confirmed. Rose Atkins. Rose? Black, listen. I know you're angry, but the wheels are in motion, and there's nothing either of us can do to stop them. I can't have anyone standing in my way, especially not you. I I'm starting to remember. I was looking for Grace. I think Rose had her. I was trying to stop her. I didn't want it to be this way, but you're now a liability. Security! Make it painless. Goodbye, Black. I'm sorry. Rose wouldn't have access to this many men. An anxious mind is likely to produce more troubled environments inside the Pandora. You're not worried about anything, are you, Black? Yeah. I'm worried about getting shot. It's not real, Mr. Black. Just perceived threat that your mind is heightening inside the Pandora. It's still fucking.
Could be fingerprints. It's a lot of money. It's a difficult job. Maybe we can negotiate some kind of deal. No deal. Take it or leave it. And what do I get in return? You get the best. You get this corner gun. No questions asked. And if it all goes south, you get to deny you had anything to do with it. I, I can't afford this much. I understand. No, wait. Yeah? I need utter discretion. Like I said. No questions asked. And no questions answered. Of course. You don't know me. We never met. I never even heard of you. <sighs> okay. You sure? I can't be fucking about with people who aren't sure. I'm sure. It's half up front, half when the job's done. I start working the moment the money's in my account. I'll be in touch to arrange payment. I'll wait to hear. So what did I do wrong last time? You just lost your way, Black. That's all. My reading suggests the majority of that memory remains unexplored. Focus this time. Assume nothing. Explore the memory in full. <laughs> Relax and explore. Very good, Mr. Black. Relax and explore.
Remember, this is exactly the same memory as the last one, just a little earlier on. We need a clearer understanding of exactly what happened. Understood. is breaking down again. So it seems. Take shelter in the filing cabinet while I sort this mess out. seems to have stabilized. Proceed.
What the hell?
Hi. Oh, hi. How do you do? What do you think? Uh, this one? Yeah. What do you think? <laughs> what a cop-out. <laughs> All right, fine. I, I don't like it. No? No. I find it derivative. Oh? Derivative how? I mean, I don't know much about art. No, go on. The subject matter just strikes me as bland, I suppose. A landscape. So what? You don't think there's value in painting scenery? I'm sure there's value in it. I just think this Lenore Thomas hasn't made any kind of statement with it. She hasn't committed to anything. She's just painted what she sees. I may as well take a photo. And how do you know she's painted what she sees? Well, it's obvious. Really? How can you tell? The composition. The composition? Yes, the composition. Composed. Fascinating. It's not clear to me at all. Maybe I just have an eye for that kind of thing. Maybe. What do you think? Oh, I'm biased. You're... Biased. And why are you biased? Lenore Thomas. Nice to meet you. Shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you do remember this place. Interesting. Please, just tell me why this is important. An unidentified man died at a nearby abandoned warehouse not long before you tried to save the girl. He was shot at point-blank range. And we're going back to that warehouse? That's correct, yes. The police wrote the whole thing off as a drug deal gone wrong. But that's not what you believe. I believe everything in life is connected, Mr. Black. The only question is how. Let's find, find out, out, shall we? Jesus, man. Get your hands off. Only Franny did. Shut up. Move. Wait. I know this place. This is where the explosion happened. Ah, yes. Your mind is preoccupied with the explosion, Mr. Black. The Pandora can only process what your brain offers. Concentrate only on the memory at hand. I am trying. And try harder. No worries, Chief. Glad to be aboard. Not a hair on her head. Trust me. You brought me here. Fuck you. Red? Hey, Red! What the hell is this? None of this makes any sense. You are here because you have formed a mental link between this man and the explosion. The Pandora is trying to decode the messages your mind is sending. Focus. That's it. 
The Pandora unit is offering you a pathway deeper into your memory. Pursue this. Focus and proceed. Remember, Mr. Black, human memory is unreliable at the best of times. I need you to work with my technology, not against it. Take in your surroundings and get as much information as you can. Scene detected. Multiple homicide. Attending officers Fair and Chadwick. What are we looking at? What the hell happened here? Multiple homicide. No ID. I will warn you, though, Chief. This is a job I skip breakfast or something. There goes any dental match. Shot off his hands too. It's a fingerprints are a bust. Professional job. Shit, this many stiffs and no ID. We can link this to a hundred cases. So, uh, drug dealer is then. What do you reckon? Adam's family or one of my Turner's lot? Uh, well, don't worry. Decide later. Get the uniforms to bag it all. I'm getting a little peckish. There's that new calf opened up next to the neck. You fancy it? Red, what is this? You are trying to process too much, Mr. Black. The Pandora cannot keep up. Concentrate only on the man you came here to find. There, there Mr. Black, right there. Use your scanner. Identify and consolidate your memory. Who is that man? The Pandora will do the rest. Confirmed. Jasper Prado. Status deceased. There is me thinking we could sort this out like animals. <laughs> you wanna do it, then at least look me in the fucking eye! So we have a name then. Jasper Prado. Boy, here's the keys, you're driving. Oh, come on, Chief. Why have I always got to drive? Rank, son, rank. What now? How do I know this? You don't. The Pandora is cross-referencing your memory with any police files, files in the database. This memory is breaking down. You must move on.
How's this sound? Keep an ear out for spelling mistakes. How am I supposed to keep an ear out? Just shut up and listen. <clears throat> West Midlands Constabulary today wish to release a statement regarding the press reports of a mass shooting that took place just outside Birmingham last week. Great, Chief. Real good. Hold up. I haven't even started yet. Oh, sorry. I'm all ears. We would like to assure the public that this incident, while directly linked to a gangland turf war, is entirely under control and has already been brought to a satisfactory conclusion. And? And what? The bomb, the girl, all the other bits of the case that the press are banging on about. No. On that, our lips are sealed. Never happened. That's what we're being paid for. I know, I know, but we've got to give them something. All right. Just mention terrorists. Yeah, the press will be all over it. And the public will be too scared to question it. See? Easy. Hang on. Who's reading this out? You. Press conference is next door in five minutes. Where the fuck are you going? Pub. to make clear that although set to read only, we will be recording as is our legal right. However, anything you do witness will not be either admissible or provable in a court of law. Hang on. I'm still not sure if this is right. I need a decision now. We're against the clock. Any longer and we risk cellular breakdown. Okay, I'm ready. Save the girl.
Hey, 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 Missy, wake up. Ah, uh, no, that's rude. That's just, that's just unhigh fucking genius, is what that is. Fuck you. Fuck me. Fuck you. I'm doing your kindness. I brought you a glass of water. Why are you doing this? Money, sweetheart. Nothing personal. If, if you're bringing me water, then you're not going to kill me. Kill you? Jesus, no, I'm not a monster. And why do I have a bomb strapped to my fucking chest? Let me go! Help! Somebody help! Just calm down, all right? You don't want to set that thing off. The bomb is necessary. I can say no more than that. Now, do you want this water or not? Gonna be... oh, fucking hell. Mike! Hey, Michael! I think she's gonna need another dose, mate.
was a bomb. A girl. Looks like I'm going to building B. Shit. Am I alone in here? No thermal readings in the area. Just me, then. system flood. That's it. Stay with us, Mr. Black. I'm pulling you out. I thought this was a simulation. I was... I was there. I could feel it. The pain. It felt That's real because your mind perceived it to be. Injuries sustained within the Pandora will have the same effect on your brain as those sustained without. Now, stop thinking, Mr. Black. Clear your mind while I bring you out. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Red. Hey, why is everyone loose? The patients must have their exercise, Mr. Black. Now move along.
So what differentiates this set of results then? Why would they be so inaccurate compared to the others? Well, I don't know for sure. You can guess, though. I can guess. So guess, Einstein. Well, in all of these tests, the subjects were largely immobile, experiencing, let's call them armchair memories. Christmas days, relaxing holidays, that kind of thing. So what, they weren't emotionally engaged with the memory? Oh, no, they were emotionally engaged, very much so. But they weren't doing much. What are you saying? Physical activity in the memory affects the accuracy of the Pandora. It certainly seems to. But I think it's more than that. This is pure speculation at this point. You understand? Go on. I think the accuracy of the Pandora may have a direct correlation to the adrenaline levels in the subject. So we can improve results with adrenaline shots? Assuming I'm correct, yes. But if my idea works, we may not need to administer it at all. We find a way to get the subjects to produce it themselves. Exactly. And I think I know how.